Welcome to Academic Game Tutorials. In this video, we will look into the differences between electric discharge machining and electric discharge grinding. Electric discharge machining is one thermal energy based non conventional machining process where material is removed by melting and vaporization with the assistance of high intensity spark. Electric discharge grinding follows the same principle of material removal, that is, melting and vaporization, but the construction resembles the conventional grinding process. Instead of a stationary form electrode as used in electric discharge machining, a wheel electrode made of conductive material is used in electric discharge grinding. So, let's look into the basic differences between electric discharge machining and electric discharge grinding in a tabular form. Difference number 1, in electric discharge machining, a form electrode made of electrically conductive metal is used as cathode. So spark is generated between the form electrode and the conductive workpiece, whereas, in electric discharge grinding, a wheel made of electrically conductive material acts as cathode. No separate electrode is used. Thus spark is generated between the wheel and workpiece. Number 2, in electric discharge machining, the electrode usually remains static, it only moves slowly as machining progresses, whereas, in electric discharge grinding, similar to conventional grinding operation, the electric discharge grinding wheel always rotates at a fixed RPM about a fixed axis, the wheel also moves slowly as machining progresses. Number 3, Electric Discharge Machining Electrode can be given complex shapes. Thus several simple and complex profiles or curvatures can be fabricated by electric discharge machining, whereas, owing to simple geometry of wheel, which is disc type, electric discharge grinding has limited ability in terms of complexity of the profile or feature that can be produced. Number 4, Electric Discharge Machining Electrode is commonly made of conductive metals like copper, brass, tungsten, etc., whereas, the electric discharge grinding wheel is commonly made of conductive but non-metallic material like graphite. Number 5. In electric discharge machining, a suitable flushing technique is highly desired for continuous delivery of fresh dielectric fluid in entered electrode gap, whereas, in electric discharge grinding, no additional flushing technique is required as the rotating grinding wheel continuously sucks fresh dielectric fluid into the inter electrode gap. And, Difference number 6. Accumulation of debris in a is one major problem in electric discharge machining. Dielectric flushing helps removing debris from inter-electrode gap, whereas, in electric discharge grinding, debris is inherently removed from the inter-electrode gap due to wheel rotation.